I'm not going with you. All right. Just so, tell okay. me what happened. So apparently, this year morning in the big city, mm-hmm. apparently, middle class Kenyans have opted to order food in. So the headline is City Dwellers Snub Home Meals. Chicken, pizzas, and burgers top the list of foods that are ordered online by middle income households. Kibe, in the digs, we're no longer cooking. I mean, we're not going out to the nice restaurants. To Nangia online, fu, 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 fu. budget junk food in a D house, Katume Angalia TV. How do you feel about it? As, as women, yeah. Uh, when I look at you as a woman, uh-huh. how do you feel if I call you over? I tell you, Menje, listen, I want us to hang out. Mm-hmm. I like you. I think your hair is not so bad. <laughs> right? I don't mind your eyebrows. You know, I like how you carry yourself. You know, you look, you, you look out. You look like somebody I'd want to get to know. Yeah. Bearer. Okay, nice. Where are we hanging out? Come to my digs. We Netflix and chill. What? So you can just order some crusty pizza with some tap water. Do, do you know this? The, an ashtray just there in front of me. Okay, weird, <laughs> dirty, crusty curtains. Why are we hanging uh, out in your house? Have you been to my digs or what? You want me to answer that question? So, excuse <laughs> <laughs> the story. In the Squeezy, uh, I, I don't know whether you guys do it, but as, as guys, when we were dating, mm-hmm. it was real dating. Now, you're t- talking about ordering food in the house. Okay, let me tell you first and foremost, this ordering food in the house, mm. first of all, let me just tell you, I have that problem. Okay. Yes. In a week, I'd probably cook like twice, dependent on what time I get home and the state I'm in when, I'm get, when I get home. So in a week, I probably cook like twice in my house. But so, I'm highly dependent on ordering in. But Kibe, that's me when I'm by myself. When was the last time somebody took you on a real date? Woo! Do you guys even know what I real... I haven't been on... I don't think I've been on a real date this year. Ah! So this your dates year. are what? For the dunda? Uko, piti at home. Hmm? Or we go... Nikopa Langata Road. But do you want it? You know, let me tell you something. You know what has happened? Mm. Do you is want that, to be taken on? Because men, we've said, we don't want to do that. Of course I too want expensive. to be taken. Do you know how much you can get from me if you take me on a date? And let me tell you, you know what has happened? Is mm. Men are just misleading each other. You guys have told each other that it's not necessary, it's too expensive, and it doesn't make sense. You know? Mm-hmm. You guys budgeted down romance and brought it down to the cheapest price. And subjected all of us to that budget, all right? When in essence, if only you knew how much of an advantage a date can give you as a man. And it doesn't even have to be something at the extraordinary, Kibe. But in, a date. in, in the defense of the man, uh-huh. right? Why buy a whole pig? You see? You see? You see? Why take the chick out you on see? a date when <laughs> if you tell her come to the dick, she's going to come? before the horse there's an issue because if women had demanded better men would be better you know we did demand better uh, you guys were just when? so busy you see like you see now you're uh, already interrupting me uh, we demanded better a long time ago but you guys were so busy just screaming and shouting amongst yourselves oh, it's too expensive oh, she does oh, and then you didn't even listen to us so you guys set a standard mm-hmm. a very poor standard let me tell you at that but because we need you imagine mm-hmm. we'll just do it so but you're, let me tell you kibe you're settling for umbude. if you took me mm. on a date oh you just say menje what are you up to can i take you out for dinner but you feel like that. Not all women feel like that. Are you crazy? It's not a common feeling because you, you guys have not been going out on dates. So you don't know it. Women want to be taken out on dates. Of course not. How? Can you miss with you, my dear? Moment out, my dear. Please. Uh, women. Uh, 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 you know, just leave it. Just, just hold on. If you don't believe when me. When it comes to women affairs, I'm the expert here. I, what? With your many years' experience as a woman. How many women have you been with? Uh, you got, I've been a woman for 27 years. But me, years. bruh. I'm going to put off your mic. Keep bruh. Me. 27 when okay, I was, fine. You I was know 19. What? Maybe you're looking at me uh, as your bro. You know, as the homie, as uh-huh. always. You think women don't want to be taken out on dates. Never. 
Just give me a call right now where you are Jum say na ni kera. Hakuna. 0711046100. Ladies. Peleka to the digs Rivanjiri. Ah ah. Ngapati wa 50 bob na di nduvi I see home. Excuse me. Call me 0711046100. Uh, no, you want to be taken out on a date? Matter of fact, let's even take it further. When was the last time a dude took you out on a date? Can we just show Kibe how these men are just a shame? Now, if you're a man and you're listening to the sound of my voice, understand this. These women don't want to be taken out on dates. Oh my gosh, Kibe, what are you they saying? They do not want to. I asked you don't to Don't lie just, to yourself. Oh Uzif Kiri, I'm giving a speech here. They do not want. They think they want. Menja, that's exactly what's happening. You think in your mind you want, but deep down you have the same primal need like i have if you are just honest with yourself okay that's why if you go to a level of honesty in terms of conversation then you're able to see eye to eye with a man very quickly okay now listen Ikebe. Mm. you cannot tell me as a woman <laughs> what i want and how i'm thinking deep inside can i ask uh, you another uh, question uh, based no, on no 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 let me finish on your what I, story let me finish what i'm saying mm. all right that's the kwanza all mm. right you cannot be the authority on what women want because you're not a woman. So you don't know where our primal need and our urge lies and how to get to it. I have a question for you. Chapili. Question. Let yeah. me ask the first question. Ask me a question. How many dates have you been asked on mm -hmm. this whole year and how many have you gone? Now, based on what you said earlier, yeah. zero. Mm -hmm. You've not gone on a real date this year. That's what you said. I haven't. Yeah because hold up i'm still asking the question no how many inboxes have you received asking for a date quite a few but you see that's a common problem all right so if you're listening to the sound of my no, voice no. Kibe, you need to let women me, don't you want to go to, on dates you need to let me finish what i'm saying yeah. okay with my experience as a woman mm -hmm. all right you ever heard that um saying that you get more bees with honey than mm -hmm. with vinegar mm -hmm. it's exactly that what is lost on men nowadays is how to be honey because you've realized you can be vinegar and the bees will still come all right no one is asking you to spend an obscene amount of money on a date first and foremost a date can be a movie some of the best dates that i've been on have been cheap off you know it can be a movie it can even be a walk in the hood that's a date but it's when a man is able to show a woman that my interest in as much as it may be carnal, extends beyond that. And that does a lot for a woman. Let me tell you, I am so malleable after a date. So, so malleable. Think about achana na kutuma fair, achana na nan, all these things men are complaining about to do with the woman of nowadays can be eradicated by a date. I'm a man of numbers. Mm. The numbers, what you say sounds good, mm -hmm. but the numbers are not in your favor. In terms of how? In terms of even you yourself. I'm just interrogating your life. That's because I'm Menji, I've known you for the last couple of years. Yeah, but my mind is wrapped around one person. So that's my problem. If it wasn't wrapped around one person, oh! Understand the problem. You as a woman don't want to go out on dates. But men are asking you. You think you have a unique problem? Effort. Now, Effort. if you are blocking all the men who are coming to you right now, think about it. Mm -hmm. A beautiful woman like you mm -hmm. is blocking men. What about other women out there? I'm talking about dates. Be honest with yourself. I think women, we have to say, just please talk for yourselves now. Because me, I feel like I'm sitting with a madman in studio. Just give me a call. And this started from online food. 0711-046-100. Good morning. Good morning. This is Kamene, yeah? Yes. Kamene, let me tell you something. Tell Women me. Women are not being taken on dates anymore. You katau, katai, pendo si pende. There's no way I'm going to tell to have my mind take her on a date when I know if I can chapa ha show a concept if I know I'm wet in my house. What? Akun eh eh moe. Akuna vinyi zampeleke inje ni ndeni mimeweki tu ya ten k ya. 25k na anipatii kitu nikimleta hapa. Wacha ni kuuliza. Na namaliza biashara. Uko na dem? Uko na dem? Eh. Wangapi? Wacha wacha hizo so. Okay, sawa. So you have a girlfriend, eh? Huh? Uko na dem. You have you ever taken yeah. her, do you take her out on dates? 
date 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 selepo kwa nanzi ya miss kuna mpeleka date date nanzi kumpeleka juzi na ni jua litisha so you take her out on dates eh yeah. kama kumpeleka kwa supermarket is a good date na kushow kumpeleka saloon na drop off na narudi yes a good date very good unajifanya kazi ya uba nini <laughs> And let me tell you something my bro, huh? Eh? Brother man. <laughs> from one woman uh, to... with women's experience, keep a shut up. Mm-hmm. One woman with women's experience. If you're not taking her out <laughs> on a date, Bazenga, there is a man who is taking her out on a date. <laughs> Changam <laughs> kia yo ka. I'm telling you. I'm telling you the <laughs> truth. Oh, <laughs> that's what you think. I'm saying if you're not taking her out even on one date, even just take her for a movie, there's a guy who's taking her. Walan shata. <laughs> Good morning. Good morning, Kamene. How are you doing, babe? I'm well. This is Eva. Unasikiza huyu mseve nyanaongea ati women don't want to be taken out on dates. He doesn't know what he's talking about. There are, like so many women who just want to have a nice time, go for a nice dinner, you know, you talk instead of these things that you oh where you are Kuja kwa nyumba Netflix and chill what is that let me ask you something yeah. if he offered if so you meet a guy yes you don't really, offered, so you meet a guy <laughs> unasikiza muziki sana <laughs> so okay. now you meet a guy he's not even good looking he's probably not your type lakini akuambi i'd really like to take you out on a date are you free on friday evening we go watch a movie and have dinner mhm utakubali ama utakubali nitakubali and then he Mita takes you out because... for this movie and you have dinner and you've had a really yeah. nice time and then he's like do you want to come to my digs utaenda ama utaenda after after the date mhm it will depend like if if the date went well then i might just say yes but if it didn't go well then maybe i'll be like okay maybe a couple more dates we see how it goes you but see? women just don't want to come at you to men's digs and just hang out what is that what is you know that? we all, we have our own houses to hang out you, do you want me or do you want the <laughs> restaurant huh no but it's nice to like get to know someone when you're having a nice meal you know yeah and then i can the also get to know you i decide to even cook you that meal imagine you know? that so the meal cooking point, the meal points go to a guy who actually takes makes effort to ask you on a date hapo <laughs> sawa thank you so much babe welcome back to the morning kiss my name is kamene goro we're just about 12 minutes away from 9 a.m and we're asking the question Ladies do you want to be taken out on a date? And I'm trying to convince men here cuz you think gentlemen let's just be honest for a minute. You've been misleading yourselves for some time. And we have bent over backwards and we've allowed the below par standards that we have now called dating. But I want to tell you that dating can work miracles. A date can work miracles. And miss me with this narrative for oh sina do it's so expensive must I spend this amount? No no no. The essence of a date is consideration. All right? All of these problems you're having with women, all of these things that you men are complaining about would be fixed by one date. Remember I told you it is easier to attract bees with honey than with vinegar. Then with vinegar. I want to head over to the hashtag Kamene and Kiben. Ona msema hapa amesema hiyo maneno ya date ni ya wazungu. And if I shall be called unromantic because of it, let me be. That's one of Moses Nyaga shame on you. And can I just be honest with you now that Kibe is not here? If you're a man right now and you're listening to me and you have a girlfriend or even your wife, shoot me. And you have not taken her out on a date or you refuse or insist that you're not doing this date maneno can i tell you right here my dear brother you have a brother out there who is taking her out on dates kindly please kindly please because the difference between you who is currently the government in power and the guy who is out there getting all of her attention is one thing a date and just that date can have you overthrown as a government in power hmm, shoot me yes it is true those dates ni muhimu kiss kenya's number one hit music station